what's up guys MC jukebox gaming here um, today I'm going to be playing Sky Island challenge once again I haven't played in a while so I thought it might be cool to do some more episodes on it um, looks like I need to harvest all my crops why am I using a pickaxe also I have decided to like throw some of my armor away I just felt that I started off with like way too much I mean the first video I had full iron and diamond armor oh I forgot to grab a hoe yeah and I have added a door off camera just for pretty obvious reasons unless I, unless I want to get killed by monsters every night You know, fastest tool I think for melons is an axe. Okay, plant some here. Um, and I guess more carrots. I think I might use carrots the most. Okay, so I'm planning on like building a bit more. Should I check for blocks in here. Alright, I got 13 cobblestone. See if I can build a bit more. And I just noticed there's a village down there. Can't really see it that well, but. Uh, mining cobblestone is one of the most boring things on here. But you know what? I still need to plant a tree. Oh, wow. Yeah, sure, I need to plant a tree. Don't mind this, like, tree right in front of me. At least this is a lot quicker than mining cobblestone, because I really don't want to take all day doing that. It looks like it's becoming day, actually. This platform looks so weird. It's just random blocks. You know what? I actually still need to build a mob spawner. I still need to build a mob spawner. Mm. You know, I might save that when I get, like, a lot more blocks that I can spare. Right now, I'm, I'm just playing, I'm just planning on, and, what is, I think that's another portal. There's another portal over there. You know what, hopefully, yeah, hopefully I can actually go to the nether. You know what, why am I still building this platform? I'm just going to, like, bridge over there. Really not looking forward to losing all my stuff if I fall, though. Armor or not, this will just kill me. Jesus has used up all my wood already. Still a long way to go. Okay, right. Looks like... Well, if I have any more bone meal, I'll probably just use that on some saplings. Unar oak wood. Okay, do I have any... I don't have any. Well, at least I have like four wood. I don't think that's going to get me very far, so I'll just have to mine some cobble. Actually, wait. You know, it probably wouldn't hurt to uh, just like chop a little bit off like the side of this tree. 
Yeah, I'll just chop like a little bit off here. I mean, it'll still look fine. You can still get up to it and everything. Should be fine. And I just thought I'd grab something else. Okay, I'm not sure if this is going to be enough to get over there, but it's a start. Okay, I'm like going like way off the edge when I'm building a little bit of this apple. Guess use this one useless cobblestone. I'm just like just spamming the wood as I'm going and grouch off the edge. I also have to remember to get like a ton of torches on this bridge or I'm going to get a load of mobs spawning on here. Just look at how long I've built this and I still haven't reached the portal. Okay. Oh, I did miss some wood. Man, I feel stupid right now. I just missed a, just missed some more wood in here. I don't think it'll be enough though, so I'm just gonna cut a little bit more off this tree. It seems like I'm, like, cutting the whole tree down, but I'm still, like, gonna leave some of it so it doesn't look t that bad. Just so it doesn't look bad. Okay, I think that's all I'll cut off it, because it's already looking a bit small. Two more melons. Yeah, I'm playing, I'm hoping that I can, um, get in that nether portal and go to nether by the end of this video. Ugh, gonna need to, gonna need to get more cobblestone from the generator. I just wish, like, mining cobblestone was a lot quicker. Still takes a while to get enough cobblestone that you need. Alright, okay, I'm gonna see if this is enough. Got a bunch of random blocks. Okay, um... Eat a bit more of this apple. Man, am I getting really hungry just building? Okay, I'm so close. And yes, if you can see the head on those displays. Okay, yes, I did build it. Yeah, I built it a while ago. Uh fairly close after I built the Sky Islands. Actually, no, I think it was after the first video. I built it sometime after. I just thought it would be cool to add. Also, I wanted to show off some of the 1.8 stuff, the armor stands. Uh, you'll see when when I can actually get over there. Actually, might as well use these now. And place them on top, so... I don't fall off. Because, like, if you place the slab on the bottom of the block, I'm not sure, but you might be able to fall off that way. Okay, I don't need much more blocks. I need a little bit more. Just careful not to fall off the edge. They really don't think I want to lose all of my tools and stuff.
Yeah, I could get like so much wood from that jungle, from that um, jungle tree. I could get so much wood off if I didn't build a tree house already. Is there any other way I can get to harvest these? I just wish the trees would grow faster. Uh, gravel and sand, of course, fall. Actually, I'm going to see if I can break any of the blocks down here in the mine. See if I can break away at some of these. And not, like, be showing the whole edge. Well, you well, you know what I mean, like the void. Because knowing me, I just walk down here and just fall right off. Ah, sand. Sand fall, sand and gravel is the most annoying thing when you're mining. I just always hate, like, if you're trying to dig up really quick, you always get... Well, you're never really supposed to dig straight up anyways. Because, yeah, I think you can see where that would go wrong. And I just destroyed a bit of my staircase. Well, I got, like, four more redstone. Don't really think that's going to be any use yet. Oh yes, one of the trees is grown. Uh, let's chop this up. Okay, I think this should be enough. Should be enough to build up and, and build a portal. I'm getting hungry again. I'm not going to be, like, staying at the nether too long. Because I don't want to spend the whole rest of the video in there. Well, if I do, I'm going to at least grab some more food. Because I've already eaten a lot of the apples just by building. Okay, should be high enough. There's one higher. And yeah, I built I built this with armor stands. Why is okay, it was a skeleton spawn egg. I just built these off camera. Thought it might be cool. These are armor stands. It's just a bunch of commands that you can do in 1.8 with the armor stands. Like add arms. Right here, there's no arms on this, as you can see. Normal ar armor stands don't. But with a bunch of commands, one of them you can add arms. Um, you can make it float or have no gravity. You can also position the legs. So here's it with our armor. You can get rid of the base of it. And I just put all this back on. And also you can, well, depending on if you have anything, or like if you have arms, then you can put something in the armor stand's hand. Oh, I just took off my head. Why can't I grab the sword? I want the sword. Why can't I take it? Yes. And I did make this too. Burning blade. I just thought it might be a cool weapon. It does do... Well, since it's gold, it does the same as a wood sword, but does have fire aspect. Um... can have some melons. There. I can't even tell the difference here. 
There he's holding melons majestically. And these are also armor stands. I made these ones invisible. Just put jukeboxes. Because, of course, MC Jukebox Gaming. So, this is just the armor stands, no gravity, and invisible. Okay, and now we shall go in the portal. But you want to grab some more food first. You know, might as well take this with me, why not? Yeah, I'll take all of it with me. I'm coming with me. Why am I so slow at doing this? I actually do know how to craft an armor stand. It is pretty cheap, but why not just take this? I might leave the other one there, though. That just looks amazing. Oh, and I just forgot. Yeah, you might have seen that, like, in the video intro. So it wouldn't be right destroying it. I completely forgot that's my new intro. I just saw a video about what you could do with the armor stands, so I thought I could make something out of that. So I built it on on this world and just decided why not? Why not keep it? There. I look so amazing. Oh, food. And I'll actually leave the burning blade here because mobs in the nether do not get, or not gain. They do not take damage from fire, so I think that'd be pretty useless. Okay, so. Actually, I'm just going to take the rest of the apples. And I'm going to the nether. The long trip back to the island. Or the other island. After I put torches down. How do I keep forgetting this? Okay, do I even have any more torches? I always keep coming back in here. Asking myself, do I have this? Do I have that? Gee. Do I still have some in the furnace and some pork? I'll save the pork in there. And put rest of this coal in the chest. And hopefully none of the mobs spawned already. Oh, I just I just saw that and thought it was a monster or a player. I don't know why. I just always do that when I see an armor stand. When it's an armor stand or looks like something like that. Um, ran out of torches. No, no, no! It's gone. I'm just gonna hope I just don't encounter any mobs. And I am going to the nether. Guess a pretty good spawn. Why is there gravel? I'm not kidding. I didn't put that down. Why is there already gravel here? Did did they add that in an update or something? I've never seen gravel naturally spawn in the nether. That's pretty weird. Oh, sweet nether fortress. I'm hoping I can get, like, some blaze rods and make brewing stand. I almost saw you coming after me. Yeah, the thing about pigmen, I just hate them. I used to... I used to hate gas the most... Oh! Oh, boys! Oh, sweet, I already got another... Or, not another, blaze rod. Sweet, I already got one blaze rod. Let's see if there's any more. I can't believe I seriously just say... I need some blaze rods, and then immediately there's blaze. Wait. Also, I'm not sure 
Why is the chest here? I seriously didn't put this down either. It looks like just normal dungeon stuff. Horse armor, saddle. Looks like normal dungeon stuff. I didn't think there were chests down here though. Actually, you know what? I'm taking this too. I'm taking that too. I'm not sure how big this is, though. It's gigantic. Whoa, what was that? I thought I just saw another blaze or something. Oh, there's more down here. Is there any wither skeletons or anything? I thought there'd be something else down here. I'm just going to grab a bunch of this. And of course you also need soul sand. If I can grab it really quick before anything comes. Okay, right, I'm just going to go put some of this stuff away. I really don't feel safe carrying all of this around. Because, yeah, with all my experiences in lava and in the nether, I really don't think it'd be... Oh, no. No, 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 no. Please, no. No, Wither, no. Ah! Oh, man, I lost all my stuff. Get really quick for despawns. I hate wither skeletons. I'm not sure what I'm going to do when I get there, though, because... Yeah, if I don't get my sword in my hot bar, then... Yeah, I'm going to die. Since it also doesn't take damage from lava. If only I left the sword here. Actually, that really wouldn't do much good either. It's like a wooden sword against the wither skeleton. Oh, where'd all my stuff go? A mag magma cube too? Run, run, boys! No, don't. It's not attacking me. Why is it not attacking me? Oh, head! <laughs> if it had one health. Skill a little bit assorted. That's all I need. Wait, I lost all my nether wart though. Really don't want to go back. On my blaze rod too. Well, like getting blaze rods is gonna be that hard. There are blazes everywhere. That's pretty weird, this normal skeleton. Actually, yeah, they do spawn. Nope. Yeah, I do know wither. or not wither skeletons. Regular skeletons do spawn rarely in the nether. I think only in really, really dark places. And I haven't gotten a single magma cream from this. Yeah, I'm just going to eat some of these apples and then go try and charge that wither skeleton. I don't know why there's so many. I thought they were rare too. Oh, geez, they're fast. Just bones. Man, no wither skull. Not one wither skull. Oh, pay pig man. Ooh, looks like nether warts didn't burn. Sweet, near did the soul sand. Okay, and I'm out of here. 
I think I've seen enough of all the wither skeletons and blazes. Now, I really should have crafted a bow before coming here. Really should have thought about that. Especially before going near the wither skeletons. Oh, I thought that was another player again. King, looks like it's day already. It's gone. But you know what? I need to find a place for a brewing room. I have two blaze rods, so I could just make like two brewing stands and go back for for more blaze powder. I'm not. I think blaze powder made strength, and I'm not sure if that if uh, that'll be that useful. I'm not sure. Okay, actually, you know I'm leaving that there. Actually, I need a door. I need two doors. And it looks like our tree has grown, so... And use this for the brewing room. You know, you know, I sh really should have, um, grabbed more nether brick or netherrack for, like, for the brewing room since, you know, kind of nether material. I think what I ought to do... Do I need a place for the door? I was trying to find a place to use both doors because I really don't have use for the other. Out of wood. I got like two. Okay, at least I can get the stuff set up, though. I'll put, um... Yeah, I'll put the... The brewing stands right there. Oh, yeah, another tree's grown. There, the trees are, like, growing at the best time, too. And harvest some of these melons. Okay. Why? Why do I keep thinking that's a person? That's my head. Why do I keep thinking it's a person? And you know, put all this away. Be amazing if we can get a horse, cause like a saddle, two horse armor. I mean, I know I did make the Nether portal, and I did make the uh, island with like the heads and the armor stands, but I did not make the chest or the Nether fortress or anything. Of course, I didn't make the Nether fortress, but. Okay, anyways, what the heck was I gonna do? Okay, so you some more. Oh! How did I forget? Craft the, the brewing stand. Okay, of course you need cobblestone. Yeah, and I might make two brewing stands just because. Strength potions really aren't that much of a use to me. I just use poison and harming, healing, regen. Just all that good stuff. Okay, sweet, now we can put this in the brewing room. I think that looks pretty good. Of course, if I get more netherrack, I'll probably make 
the brewing room out of that. So hoping I can find more. Well, not find more, find some, because I didn't really get any. Except for the three I used for the, you know, kind of table there. I think the island's doing pretty good. It's looking pretty good. I need some more torches. Cool. How many times am I planning to go in here? I don't know. Yeah, I was chopped on some of this. It's for sticks. Because I'm probably going to need a bunch of it since... Well, first of all, the bridge. I might as well say these two extra sticks there. That doorway. Torch there, torch there. Might as well put some on the back. Just so mobs don't spawn there. I really wish I can go down there to that village, but don't really think that'd be that fair, because challenge was to stay on the Sky Island. Yeah, I'm just walking all this way to put two torches on the bridge here. And by the way, guys, if you do want to know how to make these armor stands... I'd suggest watching Seth Bling's channel. Uh, if you don't know who he is, just look him up. He'd probably come up. Actually, I bet you he would. He would. I can't talk that well. Say that in every video, too. Well, one of his videos show you all about how to do all this stuff. And just the ju the falling jukeboxes look so cool pick them up yeah these are these are all armor stands when I saw his video I thought they were actually people that's really cool you can take things out of the armor stands hand okay why can I not do that come on man I want my melon back I want my melon back Okay, well, anyways, there's also... Okay, I forgot the commands of how to do all that stuff, but I do know one. And just in case, I'm going to do it on my island. It's kind of how to make... Well, his video was just about making the statues out of the armor stands. You can also do one with a creeper. I'm just doing it on my island just in case. And the command is simple. Slash summon. Uh, Reaper. And then three of these, whatever they're called. And then you want one space. And then one of those. Yeah, one space. And then you want one of those curly brackets. And then no AI. Colon one. And what this does, it makes a creeper that doesn't do anything. It sits there. It can float. Yeah, it can float. I'm just not breaking the blocks under it because I really don't have much blocks to spare. And it won't attack you either. But you can still ignite it with flint and steel. And you can attack it too. Will you attack me? Nope. Yeah, it's really cool. It works on any mob. So you can make some pretty cool statues out of that. Put like an armor stand, spawn the mob on it. Actually, you know what? I cheated for this gunpowder. I'm just going to throw it away. Throw it off. Well, some pretty cool things that you can do with it. And since you can only place an item in one of the armor stand's hands if, if you add arms. Um, in his video, he'll show you all the commands for it. Well, if you do, you can only put an item in one hand, so ev even, um, 
put like another armor stand and just basically put a sword in that one made invisible so a sword in both hands it showed you can change all the angles positions you know what I mean of all the hands legs and you can even move the body but if you do you'd um you'd kind of like make like detach it it's kind of weird it's really weird if you do that yeah, and I forgot the command for the head how useful am I um, let's see if I no nah. cuz I did it a while ago like I should not even a while ago just like maybe an hour ago I even tried again to spawn heads tested that out on some players I did throw them away afterwards of course but they're really cool they're actually you can place them anywhere break them and you can even wear them yourself but yeah it really looks the same for me cuz of course that's my skin but you can see kinda heads bigger I thought it'd be cool to try it out on my skin. Also, because I found out about those statues, decided that would be a better intro. Also, anyway, um, okay, I've been talking for the whole time, so we just about run out of time in this video. So please subscribe, like, comment, all that good stuff on this video and all the rest for more Skyblock. Um other videos on servers and many more in the future so this is mc jukebox gaming and i'll see you all next time